Well, now to the race against time in Mexico as rescuers try to save 10 miners trapped underground. ABC's Rena Roy takes a look at the rescue mission. This morning, rescuers working tirelessly, searching for any sign of the 10 miners trapped inside this coal mine, which collapsed in the town of Sabinas, just 75 miles from the Texas border on Wednesday. Officials say the mine collapsed when the group of workers breached an adjacent tunnel, causing a water overflow. One survivor, whose relatives work at the mine, is now part of the rescue himself, saying crews have to be careful not to damage the area where the workers are stuck while pumping out water. Mexican officials say five miners managed to escape, alerting authorities of those left behind now trapped between two 200-foot shafts. State officials say the mine began operations earlier this year and had no complaints or reported issues. But these kinds of collapses have a long history in the region. Last year alone, two mines caved in Coahuila, killing nine workers. And back in 2006, an explosion trapped 73 miners in a mine there. Only eight were rescued. The other 65 were killed. Only two bodies have been recovered in the years since the tragic incident. And hundreds are involved in this rescue mission, including the military and scuba divers. The divers have arrived on scene, but it is unclear if they've been able to go in and search for those workers. So far, no contact has been made with the miners. Whit. Okay, Rena, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.